in Family Guy. Who's the one that always looks to not be really originally part of the family? Well, it's not Brian. It's not Stewie. It's not Meg. It's not Peter. But it is Chris. Chris is the only one in the family that has blonde hair. I mean, maybe he could get it from Lois, because Lois originally had blonde hair in the first part of the series, but could it be possible that Chris could be not Peter's real son? So, what if this guy here at the gas station here could be, or the Mini Mart or whatever, could be... Uh, Chris's real father. I mean, he looks just like Chris, too. Like, I mean, look at He's got long hair. He's got... Uh, he's got a hat backwards. I mean, he looks identical to Chris, just like an older Chris, basically. And I don't know if they tried to make it look like this. Like, ultimately, this was supposed to be finding out that this was actually Chris's father and not Peter. I mean... This guy here is basically a complete stranger to Chris. I mean, he's only his manager or boss or whatever. And he basically listens to Chris more than what Peter does. Chris always talks about what happens and everything. And this guy always listens. Now, why would you tell this to a complete stranger? Why would you say, you know, I mean, why, why would you say everything that happens at home to a complete stranger, basically? Especially if they're your boss, too. I mean, I don't know. But that's just my theory that this is Chris's real father. And Peter's not. And like I said, he's always employed at this gas station, too. I mean, Chris might be not working there. And then he works there another time. It's like, this guy just lets him do whatever he wants, basically. But anyway, that's just my theory here, so... Episode 10 here of Cartoons Make You Think. Stay tuned for more episodes next week.